Exploring the Isodome, Part 3. Electric Boogaly. Or something. Do I want to go up or right? I'll see what's up here. Yep, I knew it was going to lead here. I don't think there's another password piece I need. Oh, so I wonder what's up with this place. It's isolated enough to think that they would give you something if you kill them, but... I bet it's just going to be like five rupees or something. Yep. That was a pretty worthless run, but whatever. Okay, let's form a shortcut for no reason, and well, not for no reason, in case I die. Ah, uh, who cool a fairy? I needed one of those. Well, I don't really. Ah, uh, come on! I just got healed. Do I want to go for the money or not? I don't need it by any means, but it's there, so I'll get it and get damaged. Through here is a shortcut back to the first floor somehow. I don't know how that works. Anyway, a password machine. This thing is like one of the coolest things I've ever seen in a quest. Because you just have to imagine how it's made. Like, where am I on the screen? I can't tell. But anyway, we've got to move right to pick the number. Yellow was four, I think. And press up to enter that. Green was two, but I already passed up two. Crap, now I gotta put in the wrong one. Okay, four, two, five, three, is that right? What the? What just happened? Oh god. Oh god. No! Okay, um... Well, that was obviously a glitch. I'm glad that it was just a repeat of that, though. And not the full... beginning. Yeah, I'm kind of weirded out now. Okay, anyway, uh, off-screen until I can get back there. Okay, I'm finally back. It's been, like... Out, like almost an hour probably because like interestingly right after I stopped recording Allison happened to get on so we talked and stuff and I gave her a picture and she loved it even though it wasn't finished and that's all good so anyway back to this I think I put in a three for the blue when it should have been a one so that's probably what caused it there we go And intense... Oh, come on. I can't be getting shot here. Intense boss time. Ah! It's a thingy. I don't know what it is, but it's a thingy. And it's actually kind of difficult. But luckily I have energy tanks in case I suck at it. You just gotta keep shooting it in the middle, and it'll eventually go down, and you gotta kill the enemies it summons. And I have nothing- ah! Ah! What's going on? Jumped around a bunch. I don't think that's supposed to happen. Is it taking damage? Come on. There we go. Come on. Ah. Uh, okay then. I think it's damage bar was kind of screwed up there. But anyway, that's over. It wasn't too bad. And Triforce Peace. Another level down. I went quicker than I thought. Let's see what we've got here. Dr. Wiley's tower. Oh god, am I going to be able to do this voice? 
Hmm, looks like our big, big hero has made some progress already. Yeah, just do what I said and bring that Triforce to me. I have an absolutely fantastic plan to kick your sorry little ass. Come on, move. You evil maniac, Mega Man won't fall for those little trucks. See, I knew she was kidnapped. Wahaha. You already took the bait, you stupid girl. Hoo hee hee. Oh, I'm bad. Oh my. No, I'm a genius. Hoo hee hee. Stupid, useless planet, but soon it will be all mine. That was kind of random. And now uh, more Elmer Fudd. One, two, three, testing, test. Oh, you can heal me? Well, now that we have a connection, I can suggest that you check out the Mega City Hobo. I just heard from the radio news that there was some kind of action going on now. Maybe that could be your next destination. Good luck. Ah, uh, that was a short one. But anyway, we've got more dialogue coming on. Coming on. Coming up. And I haven't picked out a voice for that character yet. Music has gone away for some reason. It's beat. Okay, let's see what he's gonna be. He can be uh, Coach Z. Mega Man, is it really you? I don't feel so good, but now I'll be fine. I can't do that. Never mind. Uh, I don't know what he's gonna sound like. He'll just, he'll have a really deep voice for some reason. But I'll be fine now that you are here. I just wonder how did you find me? I thought I'd never see you again when they left me in this trap. Uh, what's wrong? Oh, yes, sorry. I'm sure you'd want to know how I ended up here. Well, while Dr. Light was fixing you, Dr. Wily escaped from prison. As you know already, Dr. Light told that department member he didn't tell anything to you all because he didn't want to worry you to, uh, it's too much text. Got a job, Tor Labs, something, from Roll. Yeah, I kidnapped sister, and there's some random person in the lab. There's sleep mode. So that's what he was doing. I thought he was, like, recovering from a bender or something. Uh, <coughs> yeah, Proto Man was on a rescue mission. Proto Man. Proto Man, no. Pronato. Why did you contact me, Mega Man? What? Proto Man? Are you sure? B told you. Let me check if I can talk to him. That's something about. I don't know. Oh no, his signal is gone. Then it means. It means Proto Man was defeated. I don't know what to say. Why we cannot be that powerful? Proto Man, West, he went there all alone. He said that if he fails, you, Mega Man, you will do it. You must believe in yourself. Mega Man, do not repeat Proto Man's mistake. You need more power ups. Please stay focused on your mission. I cannot lose both of you. Hey, Mega Man, uh, look, I can fly again. Isn't that great? Now I can help you. You can fly through the world in no time. Just take this item so you can call me. It was Proto Man's, now it is yours. His voice changed again. You got Proto Man's whistle. <coughs> I'll be flying around the overworld. So if you need to get somewhere fast, just blow that whistle. It makes such a horrible noise that I know exactly where you are. Hehe. <laughs> Just remember, I can only take you to places you've visited already. Don't ask why. It must be some sort of a time time flaw. One more thing about whistle. I see how it's horrible. Those can make before machines malfunction. Even maybe enemies you don't know. You don't try. I see it. Proto Man. No, I have to remain strong. Somehow, I have to make sure that this is the last time Wily is on the loose. It is a shame that Pete can't help me only on the main overworld. Saving the world is never easy. Okay. I love how Pete's voice changed like a hundred times in there. But yeah, I couldn't think of a voice for him. So, uh, let's test out the whistle. Hooray! And takes me three inches away! That was funny. But yeah, it can also take me to Dr. Light's lab with the strange unknown girl. But yeah, uh, let's see, I've got about three mini levels open to me at this point. Plus a few more things in the overworld, so... But I'm pretty much done for now. I'm gonna stop recording for a second, and if I have enough time, I might do a little bit of backtracking in this one. Okay, yeah, apparently I had like one minute left, so... I decided to go back to the cave under Mega City. 
now I can finally reach that heart pace that I had to skip. Exciting? No, not at all, but at least I'm getting it done. Okay, heart piece. And I want to check as quickly as possible, which is probably not going to be very quickly at all if I can actually reach that one other cave, so let me pause the recording for a minute again. Okay, and here's that other cave entrance. Let's see what's in here. Ah, uh, crap, it looks kind of big. I probably don't have time for this. Well, actually, wait, I think I know where this is going to lead. Yep, okay, staircase leads to the garage. Dun-dun-dun-dun. Stops immediately.